What's up, boys? So you're getting on dates, which is good. I'm happy for you, bro. But you're never really sure whether she's into you or not. You might feel a bit confused now. I get it, bro. Women <laughs> communicate covertly, bro, which means she's going to give you mixed signals. It's your job to put your Sherlock Holmes hat on, bro, and decipher the signals that she's giving you, bro. Today's video, I'm going to give you some signs you just need to be aware of, especially when the girl's into you. The last thing you want, bro, is to have a date, go home, and the girl was feeling you, bro. You're just giving away free guts. Like, share, comment, subscribe, man. Let's get straight into it. Look at what she's giving you, man. Does she look positive? Does she look negative? Does she look open or does she look closed? This is a fir first clear sign that she's interested, man. Girls that are not interested, make it very clear. Open your eyes, read the body. Are her breasticles facing you, bro? Or are they facing away? Is that a very good indicator for me? Number two, how close is she to you, bro? I'm talking proximity. I spoke about it before. The female on the date should never be further than your fingertips. Stretch out your hand, bro. Your fingertips, she should never be that far away. She needs to be where your elbow is or closer. Where your elbow is, bro, she needs to be in there. In between your elbow and your armpit. Kissing radius. Get that girl as close to you as possible. Let her feel comfortable, bro, and in time, she'll move closer to you. Think about it. Three, you might not even notice unless you've got a foot fetish. <laughs> tragic, tragic. I know some of you done these sucking toes. <clears throat> no judgment. The point I'm trying to make is, bro, subconsciously, if her feet are turned away from you, bro, she's looking to exit that date. If her feet are pointing towards you, good sign that she's feeling you. Tip four, preening, licking her lips, touching her neck, touching the face, bro, lip glossing, fixing her hair, bro, fixing her shirt. Females do this, one, when they're feeling you, and two, subconsciously she's doing it, or consciously, to make herself look as pretty as she can. Normally they angle the neck, they show, they do it subconsciously, bro. When she's feeling you, man, she's gonna show her neck, bro. It's just what they do. Number five, this, these ones you might miss, if you don't pay attention, but like you've been watching me a long time, so you shouldn't miss anything. Number five, micro expressions. Little tear, little defaults that she does. So she might lick her lip, she might bite her lip. She might look at you in a way that she's checking you out, bro. Little things that she does that you catch. These are clear indicators of interest that she wants you, bro. And bro, that she wants you, bro. She takes her clothes off herself. Now, this is seduction, seduction frame, end game. She undresses herself, bro. Now, some of you guys like it, some of you don't. I know some Donnies that like to undress the female. I know some Donnies that don't even want to touch her clothes, bro. <laughs> but she does it herself, bro. She's ready. Guts watery. She's been ready. Mirroring. This is <laughs> Genjutsu. <laughs> no, this is um, this is when she copies you, bro, and she doesn't know that she's copying you. I talk about the triangle effect when you want to kiss her left eye, right eye, mouth. If you do that well enough, she'll do exactly the same thing. Um, other types of mirroring are if you cross your legs, she might cross her legs. If you pick up your glass, she might pick up her glass as well. She's copying what you're doing without knowing. Massive one when she invests and when she qualifies herself for you. Bro, qualifying is basically, yeah, you look like you're, you look a bit Italian, you know? You look like those girls that I saw on holiday. And she's just, oh I'm, oh, I'm definitely not Italian. I'm actually from Spain, I'm from the Basque, the northern part of Spain. She needs to speak and invest enough to affirm her position. When she qualifies, this is great for you. Down to her, proving herself for you, man. And this leads us on to simping. Girls will simp for you if you play your role properly. Hey, when can I see you again? Hey, I miss you. Hey, what do you want? I'm in the shop. Let me buy you something. Any excuse to come and see you, bro. Again, girls that send you pictures by themselves. This is a form of simping. They send you videos just to get themselves in your mind also when they just talk 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 to impress you man this is the investment that you want bro next tip or next sign she makes herself available 
girls that want you will be will be available. You donnies that have booty calls. 10 p.m. come over. And they come. They make themselves available. <laughs> she breaks rules for those alphas, 100%. Massive one. Assume, assume, assume attraction. I always tell you guys, she's on the date because she finds you attractive a little bit. It's your job to boost that attraction. It's your job not to mess it up. Remember, attraction initially is looks. But in order to keep attraction, she needs to invest emotionally. It's that emotional investment that dictates whether she's feeling you or she's not feeling you. How good are you? That is a question. And if you need help, DM me, click the links in my bio and come and join the Apex team. Come and work with me, man. Testing and compliance testing. Focus on compliance. This is how she follows your lead, basically. Can you give her an instruction and can she follow? Can you tell her to go and buy the next drink and she does it without any problems? How submissive is she? This is all compliance. Little tip on compliance, bro. If you approach a random girl and she stays and talks to you, bro, that's compliance. If you talk to her and she goes, that's not compliance, okay? So make it very simple. All right, man. Thanks for tuning in, boys. Smash the like button, subscribe if you are new. See you guys in the next one, man. Peace.